David Lock out here with the unified super middleweight champ herself in New York, fighting on the undercard of Katie Taylor versus Amanda Serrano. Talk to me, how are you feeling? I feel amazing, I feel blessed, and I'm full of gratitude. Absolutely, now it's a, it's a beautiful day now. Fight night is a few days away. What do you know about your opposition and, 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 and how big is this fight for you? Um, this is a fight that I've worked my whole career for, just this opportunity. I know that my opponent's a hard worker and she, you know, she's hungry too, but I don't think she, she got an appetite like me. Uh, so whatever she has, I got to answer for it. And I'm going to take in the deep waters and drown her. Straight up and down. Now, listen, not many people will know, obviously, this is for the undisputed super middleweight championship that stamps your name in history forever and ever. How does that feel? I'm like, like literally a kid in a candy store because this is so real to me. I've already seen this. So it's just hearing you say those words every time just makes me so grateful. And so, you know, I really want this opportunity. Like it means a lot to me. I'm not here to play. I'm here to be her ass and take the undisputed title. Straight up. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Straight up. Now, what does it feel like fighting on such a historic card as well? Well, I mean... Katie has been a pioneer, not only in professionals, but the amateur ranks where I fought alongside her. Amanda's been a pioneer in this professional game. And just to be, I'm, I'm happy. I'm, I'm really a showstopper, but I'm happy to be supporting cast because these women deserve it. And I know just having me and those ladies, even Seta Roos, will push women's boxing further in the future. So I'm just here to do my part. Absolutely. Now, uh, for, the, for the British people out there that may not have seen too much of Amanda Serrano, what is her fighting style and what can they expect to see from her on Saturday night? Um, she's a great pressure fighter. She has amazing body work. She's very tough and she, she's there to fight. Like she's right there to fight. Quick hands. It's, it's a great fight. This is a great 50-50 fight. Wow. It's How, a fight. What are you saying? How are you calling this bad boy? I'm just happy that I could fight and, and get to sit in the audience and watch them fight. I don't, I'm just here. <laughs> I'm enjoying the show. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Now, um, obviously, this is a huge, huge fight for yourself as well. Let's say you get this W on Saturday night. What next for you? I'm just going to be present in the moment. I'm really, you know, I live in a different kind of frequency. So my goal is to be present in the moment. And once I win, I'll go from there. People have, I know it's a lot of opportunities out there for me, but I just want to win first. Absolutely. Now, for any, any people out there that haven't seen you fight, what can they expect from you on Saturday night? Talking about the present moment, what can they expect for you? What type of fighter are you? Um, and how are you going to light the place up on Saturday night? Um, I get it how I live. I'm going to get it ugly. I'll make the fight ugly, pretty. Whatever I have to do that's legal, I'm going to win. Uh, people know. You know, if you see me on the zone, you know how I get down. It's fuck that hair. I want the belt. So that's how I'm coming. Hey, listen. It's going to be an absolutely epic fight on Saturday night. Make sure you don't miss it. The undisputed super middleweight championship of the world is going down live and exclusively on the zone.